Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to talk a little bit about um, NASCAR Heat 3. Um, it's Memorial Day, which means there's about four days left until NASCAR Heat 3. Um, first off, before we get into that, I just want to say if there's any noise, cars, whatever them fucking things are, but um, want to say I apologize I'm in my car the windows are down it's very hot so I apologize for any noise so please just bear with me let's get through this <clears throat> anyway um, with the game coming out so soon I know there's a lot of people that have different opinions and different things that they want changed like some people I've seen some people saying, oh, take the, um, what was it? I think it was take the squeal out of, like, the tires. As in, like, they squeal too much or it's too annoying or, you know, something in that nature. Um, I just know everybody has their own opinion. Like, they like how the game is, but it's something that just, you know, bothers them. Like, this doesn't, you know. And that's fine, you know, because it's your own opinion. But, um, for me, honestly, with the game coming out so soon, there's a very good chance, I'm going to be honest with you, there's a very good chance that I'm going to be getting in the game sooner than the 7th. And I'm not lying. If everything goes through, I will gladly show you guys to prove it. Um... But that's not what this is about. This is about things in the game that I think would need like redone or keep it the same or fixed or tweaked or this. Um, Cause like I said, we're about four days away. And um, I think overall the game is definitely a huge, huge improvement. Honest to God, I think it's a very big, big, big improvement. Um, to be honest with you, when <clears throat> when they said that they didn't have enough time to get the Unity engine in for NASCAR Heat 2, um, that I heard like towards the beginning of the, you know, before they, you know, oh, NASCAR Heat 3 is coming out, before they even announced anything, or it might have been like right as they announced something. But, um, I figured, you know, everything's going to be the same. It's going to be the same as that game. The graphics haven't changed. The, you know, the everything, you know, nothing has changed. They might have changed, like, the handlings and, uh, um, you know, the different cars, stuff like that. But as of graphics, I thought, man, we might as well just tell them not even give us a game you know give us a DLC that we can play online for NASCAR Heat 2 because that's all it is but I was wrong whether they got the unit the new unity engine in there or not the graphics look so much better so much better they got everything up in there um, I know some people are mad that there's no um, caution replays and stuff like that. Sorry, there was, um, I'm in Facebook groups and people keep sending links to videos and I'm sorry. Um, but I know there's little things that, you know, even that I want. I want the caution replays. I want the track map, you know, your league race. A track map can come in handy. If you're in second or third place and you're coming out of two, you know, you can actually see where the leader is. You know, where this person is, where that person is. It's nice to have. Do I think it's extremely necessary? No. Would I like to have it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Um... 
burnouts are back. I like that. You know. You know, even if they wasn't in this game, I would have been fine with it. But now that it's in the game, it just makes it a little bit better. Which is nice. Um, I'm just trying to touch on a couple little things. and uh, What else? The new spectator mode, I think that's amazing. I think that's great. It's going to be great for a lot of league racers and league owners. and I just think it's great. I know me, for me, I'm in leagues. I am. I'm in two. But I think in the next two, three weeks or so, I'll be in three. Could be sooner. I'm not exactly sure when that league ends. I'm jumping in for season three. But um, I honestly think that would be an amazing idea to have spotters. You know, just you and your spotter get in your own party chat. Whether you're on Xbox, PC, you know, PlayStation. I have PlayStation. So just me and my spotter, nobody else, me and my spotter get into a party chat. And it stays like that the whole game. I think that would be really sweet. I would I would really enjoy that honestly. But um the 360 cam, I love the 360 cam. You know, even if they didn't give us a 360 cam, I would have been fine with it. As long as they gave us a look back. As long as we could look back, I would have been good. But they gave us a 360 cam, so that's it's amazing. It's awesome. I'm just... Overall, guys, there's stuff I can go over for hours and hours and talk about and just talk your guys' ear off. But I'm just... You know, seeing the game, like, online and live streams and, you know, seeing all these pictures and stuff, it looks really good. It looks really good. I just hope when we get the game, it stays like that. You know, color-wise. A couple of those tracks, the colors look amazing. The lighting looks amazing. Um, I just hope it stays like that. And it's not completely different when we get the game. Because I know that wasn't the final, final, uh, final, you know, version of the game. You know, um... So, I just hope it's the same way that as we've seen it through live streams and pictures and all that, that it will be when we get it. That's another thing. The lighting in the game is absolutely amazing. My God. Yes, it sucks that we do not have night, day to night transitions. But I can also see where they're coming from. They said if you run a 2-3 lap race, the dark... Nighttime will just fly across the screen, and that's not going to be fun. Yes, there's ways around it. Yes, there's ways to do it. But I understand that. So let's just try to get the... Let's just us as fans, you know. I like 704. They've done an amazing job as of right now. Because we haven't got to play it, you know. And you got to remember, there's running 60 frames per second, so everything's going to be look amazing. But, you know, I'm, I got faith in them. I'm sure the game is going to be amazing. I know there's going to be a couple of little, uh, you know, a couple of things that we don't like, or why they change, or why they do this, or what. And that's fine. No game is perfect. It doesn't matter if you're a big, a big company or a small company. GTA, there's a lot of things that they changed or, you know, that's just, what? It's just crazy. So, um, you know, I got faith in 704 and one thing I am tired of hearing is when something doesn't work or something happens is, yes, they're a small company. I understand that. But that's everybody's excuse every time something doesn't happen. Yes, they're a small company. But excuse my language, they kicked ass on NASCAR Heat 2. Some people didn't like it. Yeah, it had some uh, iffy moments, but 
it was a hell of an upgrade from that NASCAR Heat Evolution. And they killed it, if you really want to talk about it. Just like that game, NASCAR Heat 2 to NASCAR Heat 3. As of right now, without any of the fans playing it, they killed it. They absolutely killed it. They took it to a whole nother level. So I don't want to hear that they can't put track maps in. We understand it might be hard to get it in a game because you've done so much in that game. We understand that, but at least put it in a game. No matter if it's this game, the next game, two games from now, put it in the game. It can happen. There's no excuse for it. And I'm, I'm somewhat of a patient person right now because the game is so close. Three, four days away. I'm really excited. I, it's... I just, I can't wait. I'm just, I'm ready. I am so ready. I will say this though. I just want to say, thank God for 704. 704 games. For constantly trying to improve and giving us a NASCAR game. To, I think it's like 2029 so there's gonna be a lot of NASCAR games I will say this it's just an idea some people might like it some people might not but in the future in the next five years I want to see a dirt track racing game no NASCAR no trucks no Xfinity I want to see dirt late models. I want to see big block modifieds, e mods, sprint cars, mini sprints, you know, late models. If I said that, I can't remember. I want to see it. I want to see it. I don't care if the whole thing is made up out of um, fantasy tracks. Give us that game. I love dirt track racing, so I want to see that. And, um, yeah, but anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Um, I do live stream all the time, a couple times a week, weekends. So if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, drop a thumbs up on the video. And don't forget, um, for my live streams when I do like NASCAR, Heat 2, um, if I get the early access to NASCAR Heat 3, I will be live streaming. A lot of videos are coming, a lot of content for NASCAR Heat 3. What I like and don't, what I don't like, reviews, everything. So, like I said, I'm going to wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a thumbs up on this video. And uh, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We just hit 61 subscribers. We're halfway there. I'm trying to hit my goal of 100, so if you guys can help me, that would be amazing. So, Thank you. Hit the subscribe button. Drop thumbs up on the video. And I will see you guys next time.